What's up guys, Agent Shields here, I'm back with the second stream of the day. This time we're going to be focusing on shields, and uh, yeah, uh, quick story, just quick summary, he came into New Alexandria because I've like advanced a lot of his story on here before I even streamed it. Um, he came across New Alexandria, he met some people, and um, it eventually led him to Armadillo his former hometown, which soon, um, he found out that was inhabited by some rangers, and, uh, the rangers reminded him of a group he used to run, as you can see in the description, uh, the Free Radicals. So, yeah, he's been with them right now, currently. Um, there's been a bit of a storyline with, uh, one of the saloon people. He's, a he's currently a guard at the saloon in Armadillo, so he's gonna head his... He's gonna head on down there. Um, so yeah, there's a <laughs> little bit of a story here. Um, so yeah, anyways, he came across uh, Armadillo, and at, at Armadillo he met you know some people: uh, Arizona McCormick, uh, Kathleen Mardoon, I believe is her name is, uh, Floyd Marshall, and Lincoln McCormick, and there were some others there that you'll probably end up seeing me interact with. Um, but anyhow, he's had some friends, like in Valentine, as well, um, uh, a lot to name, <laughs> but, um, yeah, so, this is one of the main things I was a bit scared of, of, on, um, streaming his shields, not because I didn't want to, but because there's already been, like, a story evolved, and it's, he's kind of, like, in the middle of one, um, not, well, kind of, not really. Uh, there's a gang he's getting information from called the Brotherhood who torture people and stuff, and there's just a lot of, like, side stories that way. So, yeah. Also, my voice is a lot deeper because Shields is 31 years old. I think, yeah, that's a, that's a, yeah, he's 31. So, yeah, that's, uh, that's about it, really. He's gonna probably head on to Armadillo soon. Uh, hold on. User yeah. left your channel. These people in state... I think they are. User left your channel. Are they? I know he has some friends in state, but uh, I don't think all of them are. Interesting. Hold on just a second, guys. User joined your channel. Well, he may give some old friends a visit. Who knows? Uh, hold on. Give me just a second. User joined your channel. User joined your channel. User joined your channel. Mm. Okay. We'll figure it out. So yeah, if you want to see more of Shields' backstory just a bit, uh, I touched a, a bit on it a bit in the description, so feel free to check that out. Just a second, I'm having a bit of a hard time getting something adjusted here. Okay. User joined your channel. Uh, you know what? He's by Valentine. I think I'm gonna go over to Valentine see if there's anything going on. Any old friends? Go Sable. There you go. Good boy.
Okay, I think I just have my chat on now, folks, so, uh, if I missed one of your messages, I apologize. So yeah, there's actually a lot more backstory Shields has um, with his time with the Radicals, but I wanted to go on and start streaming so I didn't put in as much information as I wanted to. Um, well, the main thing, I will say... Uh, hold on, am I even going the right way? Nope, I'm not. The main thing I will say is sometimes when something doesn't go really well, uh, and Shields is a bit pissed off, and if he means business, sometimes he switches outfits, and he calls himself the Courier. Now there's backstory in that on why that's the case, but like I said, I didn't have much uh, time to fill in everything, since I had to, like, queue up because a lot of people like coming to the server and everything, so, yeah. But basically, to put it short, the courier is Shields' dark side, uh, put into one character. <laughs> So Shields already in his self is a bit dark, um, he's not an outlaw, well I guess you could say he's an outlaw, but he has an honorable like heart and everything, um, oh, hold on, I may be RPing, to be continued on that. You got it. Howdy, need a hand there? Nah, I'm okay, appreciate it though. Oh, that's a nice kill you got, where'd you get him at? Uh, just on the way over here from Strawberry, so... Oh, yeah, Strawberry has a lot of, uh, a lot of good game. I know there was one pretty, uh, elk I saw. Beautiful creature. Oh, elks. Yeah. Alright, have a good day, sir. Stay you safe. Too. You as well, fella. <clears throat> That you, Theodore. I had a fella. Um, it's uh, fuck. Uh, are you Shields? Hello. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so I'm just gonna give you the quick. Uh, I had an accident. I don't remember the last eight months. The hell? You all right? Uh, a little bit of brain damage and a shit memory, but uh. I'm alright other than that. Happened a couple of days ago. I, I remember some stuff that I've read and been told, but uh, yeah. So pretty much if if I seem a bit off uh, or don't remember things, then that's why. When did this happen? Do you remember that? Uh, <coughs> just told me Saturday. I think Saturday, Sunday. Saturday. Yeah, Saturday. Do you know if they're in state at all? Or if they're going to be in state? Who? Oh. Rufus. Uh, yeah. Or actually, I don't know if he will, but the others will. Okay, I had a little boat next. <sighs> I suppose I should ask them what happened to you then. Hold on, you wanna go inside? It's a bit loud out here. A lot yeah. of thunder. 
He's one of the old friends I told you guys about. Yeah. yeah more or less, I was out fishing. Rufus told me I was out fishing with him. Uh, fell off the boat, off the front, and he, uh, he rode over me with the boat. I hit my head uh, quite a few times on the bottom of the boat. I was cooking some water, and uh, I might have hit my head on the prop. We're not sure. <sighs> At least it was just an accident and not anything intentional. Yeah. <sighs> you sure you're all right? Yeah, I may get headaches more often, and uh, you know the memory thing. But other than that, I seem to be doing okay. I was dizzy at first and all that, but apparently I had a, a brain bleed. What the doctor told her was I had to put shit in my head. I'm glad you're alright, Theodore. That could have been a lot worse. Yeah, it could have. I'm lucky. You're very lucky. Worst thing I've experienced, at least in my time, was I was hunting and I fell off a cliff after I got slashed by a bear in the back. I fell like 20 yes. feet. I'm lucky I didn't, hit, I didn't hit my head, because if not, I would have been a goner. Alright, well, do you remember uh, Robin and Ellen yeah. and such? Yeah, I met all them again. Uh, I remember a little bit. I met, uh, you know, the what I assume is the whole crew. You know, Ellen, Robin, I know John, Dre, or I met Dre. You know, I know John, Rufus, Roger, who apparently is out of town. Uh, I met Rocco, Ethan, and uh, I have yet to meet this Billy Bell. Hello there. You, uh... Is it just me, or am I seeing him inside you? Who oh, now? Uh, someone's right beside you. I don't know if you see him or not. Yeah, no, I, don't. I don't. I don't. Alright, that was a bit strange. It's better now. there's someone in front of you? Okay. No, not anymore. Was, I don't see him. It was probably just my eyes playing tricks on me as all. Well. Okay. <sighs> Alright, well, uh, I was actually Ooh, trying yeah. to, uh, find Robin and, uh, Ellen and such. I, uh, They'll be around sometime soon. Speak of the devil. Uh, Eat it, sucker! What the hell? Sorry, didn't give me much of a choice there. What the hell was that? He had to light four bullets in his head? Deputy! He's a very heavy man. He's yeah, very he's... Uh, he's, yeah, that, he has got a piece of it. Okay, okay, hang on. Let me just try and... Oh, now these horses are freaking out. Holy hell! Well, he's very heavy. I can even try him. Let me try him. Oh, no. Watch out, watch out. Watch out. Sir. Oh, never mind. Oh, my eyes must be playing tricks on me today. Uh, I think uh, it's the town. Probably is the town. It's Valentine after all. All types of shit happens in Valentine, so. Uh, because he tried to shoot Molly. Just finish. Alright, have a good day. The horses are freaking out, but I think everyone else is alright. Yeah, guys, um, I'm experiencing some, like, audio glitches, like, that NPC talking sounded like it was right in my ear, that was weird. <laughs> I 
Howdy, Robin. Hi, how you doing? I'm alright, how about yourself? I'm doing good. There, uh... How's everyone been? I hear, uh... I hear Theodore over there got himself in a boat in an accident. Yeah, he doesn't remember a lot. I had to basically reintroduce myself. That's a shame. I mean, you know... Listen, you can start a whole new friendship. Oh, that is the true. same person, you know? <laughs> yeah, a bit odd, but mm -hmm. yeah, that's, that's about right. Well, uh, how's everyone else been? How, how have you been? Um, you know. Uh, good. Good. Are you sure? You don't have to be afraid to tell me anything, Robin. May not exactly be a business partner at the moment, but I'm still a friend. I know, it's just, I feel like maybe almost like the less people that know, the better, and... Apparently somebody is hiring people to come after me. What? I don't know, I don't, I don't want to talk about it. It's... Go get how... source, it's like it's freaking out. Yeah. How long has this been going on? I just found out yesterday, so I don't know how long, but I mean, I know why. Wanna get to know me better? What'd you do? Two... I told two different individuals in the span of two days that I would not be forging a death certificate and faking somebody's death. So someone they tried want... to tell you to fake someone's death? Yeah, to forge a death certificate, and I told both these people, know. absolutely not, User I will not be doing that. One offered me a thousand dollars to do it, and I said no. And whoever it is, it's one of the two, because it's two totally different people. They wanted me to fake deaths on, and so on and so forth. User joined your channel. They uh. User joined your channel. Do you know who uh, exactly was doing this? I mean, I know who I told no to. What was his name? I don't know his last name, but Buck. Buck, I, I've heard the name. I don't want to say it's Buck Blair Am and I then JJ Cray. JJ, oh, it's one of the Crays. Mm. I told him uh, no, I told Buck no, and Hector came up to me yesterday and said that somebody tried hiring him to kidnap Ellen to send me a message and say that I should have taken the deal. What time did this and happen? Coming after me. This. Which part? Just everything so far when you got threatened and with Ellen. How, was, did this all happen at night? I was told or did this it... last night. How long it's been going on because, like, they, they approached me like a week ago or two weeks ago. Asked to do this, channel. so I don't know if they're still looking to hire somebody or what, but Hector's told them that he wasn't going to do it. So I don't know. <sighs> Regardless, I don't want to get into it too much. Uh, it's it's okay. I, under I understand. I, don't, I won't ask you anymore. Do you know anyone else who knows about the situation? Maybe they're more comfortable talking about this. Ellen. I would write to Ellen. There's this, uh, buck. I, I don't know the fella, but, uh, apparently the rangers and armadillo, they don't like him at all. So, whatever, whoever he is, he's up to no good. If it's the same buck, I'm sure there's probably a lot of bucks, but if it's the same buck, it may be connected. I don't know. <sighs> well, I'm glad you're yeah, alright. Just... Yeah, I mean, Hector told me it's not buck, so I'm, I'm gonna imagine it's the craze, but I, I don't know 100% for certain, so... One of the two. Before I drop this, do you, who who did they want you to fake their death? Who's whose death did you, they, they want didn't you to say. fake? All right. I'll be okay. I'm just saying, like, if you hear anything or like hear anybody asking around about hiring somebody to take me or Ellen, let me know. Sounds good. All right, thank you. Just, just also, I'm glad you're um, alright, by the way. Also, if you could do me a solid a favor, and uh, when you are awake, keep Ellen safe. User joined your channel. Alright.
I will. Okay, thank you. Do you know if Ellen's gonna be waking up anytime soon, or uh, is she? She's gone probably for the on night? the second train. Uh, second train. I'm wondering if I should it head over there be. myself, but I, I don't know. Wait, it's up to you. Do you know these people who uh, did this? Were they favoring the second train or the first? I don't know. Hmm. I know. I'm pretty sure Buck frequents the second train. Craze. I have no idea. <clears throat> okay, is there anything else? Nope, that's it. How's you and uh, John? I know you all have been uh, yeah. traveling together. Uh, you know, um, <laughs> we're kind of living together right now and we're seeing each other, I guess. Uh, of course you are, of course Easy you are. Your channel. Take it easy, okay? It just... Uh, Give me uh, a break. Uh, Give me a break. Uh, uh, uh. Give me a break. Uh, 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 uh. -huh. <laughs> well, I'm happy for you, Robin. I'm glad you're happy. Mm -hmm. Thanks. What about, uh, are you, uh, taking with everything going on? You're trying to stay low on funerals and such? Uh, no. I'm waiting for funerals, so we'll see. There's a few of them. Like, I have, like, five or six I've written, but, um, for next to kin, but channel. nothing, really. Alright. Well, if you need an extra Paul Bear, I, I know I don't officially work, but I'll be glad to help you if you need it. I appreciate it. Alright, I'm gonna go, uh, walk around, see if anyone else, uh, is around. I know Theodore's around, uh, you're around, uh, hope is that Dre back there? That's John. That's uh, John. Alright, better go see your lover, Miss Robin. Yeah, shut up. Get out of here. <laughs> Howdy. Howdy, miss. That's funny. Alright folks, it looks like Shields can't really do anything else here. Robin's with her, uh, lover, so that should be alright. However, I have bigger issues at hand. As you said. However, you and your pack of rodents start giving me problems again. Then you'll find out. What I am truly capable of. Well, good news. Uh, they don't exist around me anymore. Many don't. You're a liar. I'm not. Literally have not been running around with them for three weeks, a month maybe. Uh, no Floyd, no Declan. Nope. They all invest a lot of their time in Angela. As you can and, tell, uh, you try and to who's, who's, get who's a this fucker right here? I don't. Uh, howdy, sir. I don't know. It seems like he just decided to walk up and listen, I guess. Uh, and then who are you? Oh, you can call me Anibal. Pleasure to meet you. And you are. And... <laughs> In the way. Why are you really taking place in our conversation? I thought I uh, recognized this uh, lady right here, but I don't think I do. I'm sorry. What's uh, what's your name, Miss? You look a lot like someone I know. Probably because I am, but again, I don't know. 
uh, if it's the really smartest idea to intrude on a conversation. Uh, it's alright. I'm sorry about that. I'll let you be. No problem. Uh, sorry for the confusion, sir. Carry on. Problem. Well, I don't know who the heck that guy is, but, uh... Mm. Ah, lucky, lucky, lucky. What have you done? What have you gotten yourself into, Lucky? Why did Armadillo come up in the conversation? That business is my business. So yeah, uh, I didn't say this in the description, but I am a security guard near Armadillo with the Rangers and um, uh, McFarland Ranch. So, Shields works security for now. He is going to uh, keep a close eye before he goes on to Armadillo. He's going to probably uh, talk to Lucky and ask what that was about. Number one job is to spread the good, good word. Hold on. Uh, you can play that guitar there, sir. See? Are you giving him permission to play the guitar? Or are you saying he can, he's good at playing it? <laughs> well, music's coming out of it, right? Yeah. Seems very uh, like enjoyable, it. so I'd say he's pretty good personally. <laughs> but that may just be a personal opinion. <laughs> See why you're not playing like that, man. Uh, I'm sorry, say it again. No, I'm asking him where you learn to play like that. Oh, my papa. He's a Sicilian, big time gangster, but he loves the guitar. Sicilia. Si. I think that dude's Javier, but I'm gonna ask anyways because Shields He's doesn't a know. Weird family. But I love him. What's uh, what's your name? Me. Yeah. Guitar. Guitars. That's <laughs> Guita me. Guitar, guitar. <laughs> no, guitars. See, as many guitars, man. See. Oh, you play really nice, Mr. Guitars. See, thank you. Alright, take it easy, folks. Okay. Likewise, you need to ride anywhere, you let me know. Alright, sounds good, thank you. Interesting. What kind of my big game button? Mm, this artist is very sus. The art of death. The artist. Interesting. That's an interesting. Uh, I, t I think that dude's a killer, but, uh, yeah.
would you say your name was, fella? Arnie Ball, and yours? Party. I'm sorry. What was that? What'd you say your name was again? I, my my, my uh, ears uh, started hurting for a second. Uh, Hardy. Ah, Hardy. Well, pleasure to meet you, Hardy. I hear uh, you, uh, you frequent Armadillo. Um, why do you ask? I frequent a lot of parts. I like Valentine, I go to Rhodes, I go to St. Denis, I go all around. Yeah, I'm sure. However, you frequent Armadillo quite often. Correct. Why does it matter to you? Um, are you concerned? I'm not saying I'm concerned, I'm just asking why it matters, if I frequent Armadillo or not. Um, because Armadillo, uh... Don't really have the best kind of people. Mm. Why do you say that? You know, vigilantes, cowards, uh, cowards who like to stick to their pack. And you know what? Someone like me, I hire friends, do not get me wrong, and guns. But it's always good to have friends and guns and such. And, but you see five others around me. No. No. Oh, wonder why. Hmm. Cause I ain't no coward piece of shit. User in your yeah. channel timed out. Hmm. Well, I think people with friends that I don't think that necessarily makes them cowards now, does it? I define uh, cowards as people who run away from problems and don't want to face them head on. Hmm. I call people cowards, people who try to, uh, intimidate folks and act like they're all that and all big game, and in fact, inside, they're just gutless individuals. Hmm. You understand that feeling? Uh, no. Maybe. You, you don't, uh, you don't think that of me, do you? I'm sorry, say that one more time. Say that, um, you don't think that of me, do you? No, I didn't say I did. I'm just, uh, pointing out what I see, what, what I think cowards are. There are those type of cowards, like, uh, what's that group called? O'Shea's? Yeah, they, uh, those people, you would say, are cowards. Uh, <sighs> tried to confront problems on me, and, uh, it took three of them to try to kidnap me. They didn't want to face me head on. Had to throw their, they had to point their double barrel shotguns or whatever the hell they had and point it at me. And, uh, yeah, they s basically people who can't face you one on one. I, those are the type of people I have problems with, is all. And, uh, what'd you do to uh, the O'Shea's to get uh, them so riled? User joined your channel. Uh, it doesn't matter. Their feelings get hurt really, uh, really easily. So, who knows at this point? Uh, well, it, it, it can matter. Did you go to the deputies about them? Did you shoot one of them? Well, well, I went to the deputies, but you know, deputies—they don't do shit. So. Hmm. And uh, what did you go to the deputies about? Why does it concern you? I've gone to deputies many different times. I went to deputies when I was a young boy, 24 years old, over the death of a... or the kidnapping, at least, of my uh, soon-to-be wife, and they didn't do nothing. So I had to set out by myself, and I found the bastards and put them down. Hmm. Uh... I imagine if, if you spent time around Armadillo, you know who uh, Floyd is. Hmm. Uh, name 
name rings a bell. I did not hear you. He's dying slowly. That's just a big shame. Where I suppose could be seen as such. Uh, I mean, I, I would prefer it to be a little bit quicker. If I uh, remember correctly, Floyd likes to fight. At least from what I hear of him. <laughs> Floyd is a coward. Oh, he's a coward, huh? Maybe you should tell that to him and to his face. Or maybe you can uh, tell him for me, pass the message along. Since, you know, uh, he likes to coward. Mm, okay. And where should I uh, tell him that you'll be, in case he wants to face you? <laughs> ah! Um, I do things on my time, where I please as I see fit. As you see fit, okay. I'm just saying, you're, you're, you're back talking about Floyd supposedly being this coward, and you're tr not, uh... If, if it's that's the case, if you're not the coward that you say Floyd is, then you'd say, I'd fight you any time, Floyd. Any time, any place, anywhere. <laughs> just, just a Any thought. time, any place, around his friends. <laughs> I'm no, uh, no idiot. Around his friends, huh? Well, who says it has to be around his friends? If you need me to pass this uh, message to him, then uh, maybe you can tell him where to meet. And if I come across him, I'll tell you. I'll tell him that. Uh, hey, this this boy. You you know him. Uh, what'd you say? Your name was Hardy. Hardy. He challenges you to a duel at this place, or he challenges you to fight him at this place. Would that make you feel better? Uh -oh. Uh, perhaps I heard you incorrectly. You said, uh, boy. Oh. Boy, man, whatever. Uh, no difference, right? Yeah. Same gender, right? <laughs> Do you know who I am? Mm. Uh, you said your name was Hardy. Of course I know who he is, chat. He's literally someone I want to kill right now. Have you heard about me? Things I've done. Oh, so what? You're this big badass uh, gunslinger or something? Something. You know, it sounds like you don't want to answer. Uh, I was at... I I threw out a guess. You said, do you know who I am? And I asked if you were a big badass gunslinger. Is that the case or not? Guys, I want to kill him so badly. Oh you my god. Had, uh, an attitude on you. Uh, well, if you call it an attitude, then yeah. You could say that. Hmm. I've just, let's just say, I've seen a lot of shit in my time, and I've come across a lot of people who, who tell me, oh, do you know who I am? I'm this person, I'm the best slinger in the West, and, uh, they end up being the complete opposite. So, pardon the attitude. Oh my god, I want to kill him so badly! <laughs> So, who are you then? Uh, you ever been to Van Horn? Uh, yeah, I've been to that. It's a bit of a shithole, but yeah, I've been there. Uh, uh, I am on my way there to, uh, to, uh, and, and give some payment someone uh, if you are a whiskey drinker you and I can ride down together interesting proposal 
how long will you, uh, you said, well, I've tried the whiskey at the saloon there. It's not my favorite, but I could perhaps ride down there. Mmm, guys, I want to kill him so bad. Uh, well, I am, uh, I'm leaving now. I'll see no one besides these two. Howdy, y'all. Howdy. How you doing? If you're leaving now, I suppose I'll, uh, follow you there. I thought you said you didn't have any friends. <laughs> Y'all okay with uh, that? No, I have friends. I do not keep them attached to my hip. Mm. Okay, then. Guys, I know this Maybe is a we'll trap. I literally know this is a trap, yet. but, like, I don't know what Shields is gonna do. He could either ditch and, like not find Hardy again, or he can follow him, kidnap him, take him to Armadillo, throw him at Floyd's feet, and something like that. I don't know. <sighs> so, you like Van Horn, huh? Uh, what do you do for work? Oh, different things. I specifically like, uh, Doing the uh, dead bounty targeting from the uh, local sheriffs at the, you know, roads. Strawberry. Wait, no, not strawberry. Uh, mainly roads, though. Like I said, I like that area. What about you? What do you do? Whatever I can get my hands on, I suppose. Mister. <clears throat> now, uh... Would you say you are friends with those down in Armadillo? Or you are just aware of them? probably say just aware of them. I mean, I've seen them once or twice riding down there. I like the area, especially Tumbleweed. Tumbleweed's really peaceful. You know I'm not telling Hardy crap about the Rangers. Uh, why so uh, curious, if I may ask? What about you? You you're friends with the uh, people down there? Uh, no. I wonder if this, uh, killer that I've been seeing on the telegrams, I think it's a killer, known as the Artist, that's really interesting. I may check telegrams to see if he's, uh, said anything else. Very fascinating finding art in his, uh, killings. That's gonna be an excuse for me to say, yo guys, get down here. Um, what is your, your last name? You not mind me asking. Uh, Shadeen. I think that's how you say it. Shaden. S H A D I N. I call it Shaden, but uh, some people say Shadeen, Shaden. That sort of thing. It all depends on your dialect, I suppose. Goodness. You don't know how to say your last name. I said, Shaden. That's how you say it. Uh, what you but supposed? what I was, but what I was saying was that uh, a lot of people, I, I know some tribesmen, call me Shadeen because of their accent, their dialect. Mm -hmm. If that makes sense.
So this person you're gonna meet, this uh, friend of yours, what's his name? Uh, Adam. Adam? Interesting. I'm gonna check to see if this uh, artist person wrote again. And you guys know what I'm gonna do. Uh, seems I uh, have to catch a train. Oh, I'm sorry, say that again. Hello. Seems I have to uh, catch a train. Oh, you have to catch a train to meet your friend, huh? Uh, for some other business. Uh, for some other business. Okay, then. We'll have to uh, get that drink sometime, uh, Hardy. Mm. Uh, maybe you'd like to uh, do me a favor. Hmm. Favor, huh? Mm. Um. See, I am willing to uh, to pay you since you are a frequenter of many towns, or especially on Manila. Uh, for any useful information you can gather about those down there. Interesting. Information, mm. you say? Any, uh, mm. on anybody specific, or just the whole group? Uh, the whole group. i like to know about the ongoings in Armadillo. Or things you hear. Okay. I'll, uh, I'll definitely put that in mind. Mm. Alright, I'll see you later, Hardy. Mm. You can uh, send a letter to Kenny Hardy. That is my name. Kenny wow. Hardy, huh? Okay then. Mm. Alright, good luck on your train stop. Mm. Of course. Bruh. You guys don't know how bad I wanted to kill him. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. So, I didn't put this in the description because like I said this has been like in the middle of a storyline, but that dude Hardy, he's been he was harassing a girl in Armadillo where I work. And, of course, I was playing dumb, so I was saying, oh, no, I don't know anything about them. So, yeah, that's, uh, mm. That's, uh, and Floyd said he wanted to die soon, so. User left your channel. He's uh, unfortunately trying to kill his character off. So if that's the case, then, uh. Oh, uh, maybe I can set something up. That is, uh, mm, that was good.
pretty interesting RP, not gonna lie. User joined your channel. see if uh, Floyd uh, wrote me back. I don't think he did. Hopefully he's not on his way to Van Horn, because that would have that sucked. Oh. Mmm, that RP. Some meme. I think I missed that HRD. I don't know if it was something I said, or, uh, or what. I think I missed what you said there, HRD. <clears throat> Yo, Nairu, what's up, man? I don't know how long you've been uh, watching, but uh, there was a bit of some RP going down with a dude called Hardy. Yeah, so I didn't put it in the description. And I feel so bad streaming this, but HRD told me so many times, yo, if this this RP is as good as you're saying it is, and everything, like, from what I've hear, you need to stream this. So I'm just like, you know what, fine. But, uh, basically, Shields went down to Armadillo, he got a job there, he met people, uh, there's this one chick there called Kathleen, and, uh, she's been getting harassed by Hardy. Like, he keeps sending her, like, love letters and stuff, and she's like, you know, buzz off. But, uh... Yeah, so Shields, he's security there, so he's taking his job really seriously. Not to mention the Kathleen chick that I, uh, am telling you guys about. She reminds him a lot of his previous lover that he had, uh, called Scarlet. And she was, she died a few years prior. Or, supposedly, died a few years prior. <laughs> she basically, like, bled out in his hands and stuff, so that was sad. But, uh, that's the story on that. So, he's kind of taking the security job really seriously, plus not to mention the, ra the rangers down here remind him a lot of the Free Radicals, which was his old group. So, yeah, he's, um, I think Shields is probably the most invested I've gotten, like, in a backstory for him, but, uh, yeah. So yeah, Shields is going to be on his way down to Armadillo, and he's going to be kind of pissed. Because he's like, I should have shot him when I had the chance. But, you know, through the communication, maybe he can set something up. Between Hardy and Floyd. Because Floyd said he wanted to, uh... Unfortunately, he has tuberculosis, so... If he is a foe... Yeah, so, Hardy is a foe right now. Hardy's a foe to the Rangers, and... Shields works with the Rangers, so basically uh, Hardy's a foe to Shields, but uh, Hardy doesn't know I'm riding with the Rangers, so I'm kind of keeping that under wraps right now. I'm going to probably talk to like the manager of the saloon and everything, and um, talk about something that could happen. Because Hardy thinks I'm on his side, and I'm going to be giving him information and such, so... But, he doesn't know that I have a plan. He lucky that RDR2 doesn't have crossplay? Bruh, it's, uh... Man, if it was crossplay, that'd be dope. 
Again, this is an RP server, so there's obviously rules and stuff, but... Man, when I was talking to him that whole time, I was telling chat every time. I was like, bro, I want to kill him so badly. But, you know, Shield is smarter than that. He's not someone who just shoots randomly like that. He's going to devise a plan. And, uh... That plan's going to involve the Rangers getting retribution on him instead of just shields. Plus, Shields has orders from one of the managers there, Arizona, to not um, lead Hardy back to Armadillo, so... He's kind of trying to keep that under wraps for now. That was definitely um, interesting RP a few minutes ago. We'll see what happens. Well, HRD, if you're still there, there you have it, man. You're watching the plot thicken. <laughs> Sir. User left your channel. There's no cougar. I mean, at least not yet. Oh, wrong way. Okay.
Gotta love long rides to Armadillo, dude. Okay, I passed Blackwater. I was about to say, did I even pass Blackwater yet? Man, if only shields had some of the radicals with them, that would have been just amazing, dude. <laughs> Boys, armadillo, dude. Hopefully, people are here. Fire's not going. Because I was about to say, did I ride all the way down here for nothing? <laughs> I should be here. I think there's some people in server, so they should be here. This is when shields and the gang there usually come on, anyway, so. Oh, yep, someone's here. Don't get my telegram. Oh shit, no. I haven't been to the telegram since. What about Floyd? Did I he get up. my did he get my telegram or has he not been around? What did what did what did what did, what did, what did the telegram say? <sighs> I came across the bastard Hardy and Valentine. He was talking to Lucky and uh, her friend, I don't know what his name is, but he started shit talking about Armadillo and how she needs to stay away from us and everything and you, you know, she he's basically trash talking 
he then approached me. He he then he then approached me and he talked to me for a bit and he said he said uh, he, he asked for my name I, t I only said Anibal which is my real name uh, and uh, he said that he asked me to ride to Van Horn with him and I swear so many times I wanted to put a bullet in that guy's head so many times but I'm part of me is actually glad I didn't because through that I was able to get some information out. He's trying to hire some people to spy on us and get some information fed to him. So maybe that's how he's understanding that Kathleen's always around and such and such things. He said he'd offer me money in order to give him information and such. Hmm. So I'm playing along look, his little game. Does he look badly injured? Uh, I honestly couldn't tell. Yeah, he talked about you, Floyd. He said you were a gutless coward. I'm a gutless coward. He's one to talk. Yeah, exactly. I, um, uh, well, um, I don't know if you overheard, but, uh, Hardy offered to pay me money to give him some information about us. <laughs> and such thing. Yeah, and I think it's the kind of funny. Coward. Yeah, I think it's kind of funny if Hardy's talking shit about Outlaw's Rest. Uh, it's probably good for business. Well, I guess you could look at it that way, yeah. <laughs> yeah Hardy don't like us means we're probably doing something right. Uh, he said that Floyd was a gutless coward because he's always by by your side and everything, and he I, I can't think of the exact word he used. Mm. But I swear so many times I wanted to put a bullet in that guy's head. So many times. He's lucky I didn't. I'm a gutless coward because I have friends and he doesn't because he does stupid decisions. I guess you could say that, yeah. I even I even uh, talked a bit and I said, well, I hear Floyd's actually a good fighter and uh, he's known to, uh, you know, be the opposite of what you claim he is. And he said, uh, well, tell me. And then he just started mocking you and saying, well, why is he always by his friend's side and, you know, and I even offered. I said, well, hey, because he, he asked me to send you a message saying that you're a coward. And uh, I said, hey, well, why not if I tell Floyd to uh, duel you? And uh, he said, he doesn't make the decisions I do at my time, my turf, what, whatever the hell he said. I honestly can't remember exactly what happened because I'm, I'm just... <sighs> Hola. Oh, there you go. I didn't do it. Howdy, fellas. Yeah, what is with the gun? Oh, okay, okay. Oh, no. Can I get y'all something to drink? Alright, tequila, come right up. Speaking of Kathleen, where is she right now? I'm not really sure, to be honest. Did she wake up or something, or she not even I, woke up yet? Frank says Why? that he saw her run by on her horse uh, through the windows, but I'm not really sure. One shot of tequila for you, that'll be two dollars. What about you, sir? Yeah, Shields is pissed, guys. <laughs> he is very mad. I guess you have a way for you. Frank. Fuck. I'll see where Ruth went. There you go. It's two dollars. And Mark. you, sir, what can I get you? I don't drink. User joined your channel. Fair enough. Would you like some water, some coffee? Uh, no, I'm okay for now, thanks. It was All on right. the roof of Telegram last I saw her. I'll be right back, sure. How about you, sir? We're coming to get you. Alright. I'll take that one. User left your channel. Uh -huh. User joined your channel. Hello, amigo. Oh, if it isn't Mr. Guitar himself. Let's see. Guitars, plural. <laughs> Mr. Guitars. Let's see. That's me. Well, nice to see you again. 
It's, it's been like uh, 30 minutes. There you go. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Water's on the house. Long time no see. Well, uh, it's been time. a very long time. <laughs> User you joined your channel. You are looking for a lady. Is that what you said? No, 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 just, uh, her name's Kathleen is all. Have you heard of her? Yeah, no. Hmm, yeah, but that's, that's... Yeah, I was just wondering where she went. Apparently she rode off, so... Well, she like, uh, a woman, like, you love her. Thank you, know. <laughs> no, I wouldn't say that. <laughs> yeah, just okay. a friend. Just a friend. Oh, she do it like that, eh? Just a friend. I'm sorry, amigo. <sighs> it ain't like that, <laughs> but okay. <laughs> So, uh, it's okay. what brings you fellas down here? Mm. We heard you, uh, the bar was up and down here for you to be coming to say hello, offer up our business and such. Yeah, of course. What kind of, what kind of business would that be? Uh, we run a wagon business, you know, for transport of goods, supplies, people, don't matter. Yeah, it's, uh, is that that telegram I saw earlier? Yeah, it's that's 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 Yeah, probably. Yeah, all right. Made Nicholas sound. Well, he knows if he said it correctly, though. He's an idiot. Got the end. Well, fucking okay, we'll now was rest. <laughs> I appreciate it. Thanks, Pete. I'm Frank. Frank Moses. Nice to meet you. Likewise. You bastard to my rights, Nicholas. <laughs> Your adopted father was Sicilian. You must have uh, seen some big men as well. You can say he's a bastard, but I'm gonna uh, very full of that save baby. my judgment. <laughs> Usually they That's like a, a short and wide, not big and fucking big. Dump, 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 dump. I ain't jealous of <laughs> shit. Can't take you anywhere without you running your mouth. I could shave my head bald and fill my face with scars. I still be better looking. Mm -hmm. So is that what y'all do, huh? Wagon business? Yes, sir. Uh, how long you done that? Since I came to the state, so a few months now. All right. Hard to remember exactly when I got here. God, you're fat as hell. Hey, Nick, why are you pushing like that? Hey, Dan, you just leaned his fat ass on me. Uh, just so you two are aware, we do offer bar fights for a fee. We have to pay to fight. I mean, well, it's mostly to cover damages. And, oh, okay. You know, okay. we'll take furniture and the leg. I mean, y'all are All free right. to try and hit each other with the chairs and whatnot. Like, like I said, it covers damages. I mean, if you can, if y'all can break that fucking clock over there, I'll definitely actually end up paying y'all for it. So. You're chat shooting. Yes. Doesn't work. Oh though. yeah. We've shot it with a shotgun. Fucking tried to try to obliterate the the fucking thing. It's I don't know what it's made out of, but it won't stop working. Glad it on fire. Have we have we tried that? I don't think we want to. I don't want this place burning down. I don't think that's such a good idea. Yeah, no, this place is a tinderbox. Let's not. Yeah. I think that goes to show that you're uh, one thing you ain't willing to do is probably the one thing that'll do it. Well, um, at a certain point, you have to ask yourself if it's worth it. Every day. Uh, is it worth burning the whole place down just to get the clock to stop? Nicholas thinks so. <laughs> it's one whistle, like yes, and two whistle, no. Mm -hmm. And okay. three is just him. Jibber jabbering about bullshit. Okay. Sometimes he just starts going, and I don't know what he's talking about. Uh, 
Uh, should I liven the place up, Miss Sari, with uh, some music? Yes, please. I mean, uh, I can liven it up if I want to. Uh, yeah, this is Mr. Uh, Guitar Man here. <laughs> so you, you wanted to liven here? Yes, please. Okay, what was your name, amigo? Uh, you can call me Anibal. Okay, okay. Don't move, don't move. Just right there, right there, okay? Yeah, all right. I missed. I'm sorry. Uh, I'm all right. You're not, in, not in the mood, amigo. Fuck, kind of a buzzkill. Like I said earlier, we are for bar fights, but for a fee. If you want to fight, you can take it outside, or it's going to cost you. I thought you... I paid for the bar fights, $5 cover. How much we charge for bar fights, Ari? Five bucks seems fair. Yep, five bucks seems fair. Okay, it's paid for. Ready, amigo? <sighs> you want to fight me? Yeah, I'm going to fuck you up. It's been a while since I've done it, so why the hell not? Okay. No pulling any weapon. Ah. Right, I tripped. I'm sorry. I had to grab onto you. You helped me. Oh my god, you're gonna shoot me. Uh, that was unintentional. No, it's okay. Wait, it's why, can I, why can I... Why can I, uh... Why are you running? Fuck. I literally can't punch. I don't know why I can't punch. I literally can't punch. <laughs> I think I'm pussy right now, amigo. Uh, uh, for some reason, my uh, punch muscle ain't working. Hey, yeah. It kinda, it sounds like a punch the problem, amigo. I'm just getting beat up, guys. <laughs> uh, I don't think he's aggressive enough. Uh, hold up, maybe this will... Uh... Right. I'm just gonna let it beat you up? I mean, it's okay, I don't mind. Okay. Uh, bit rusty, boys. Boys. Oh, lag. Not too good at this, amigo. Uh, oh, my bad, Nicholas. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, you're gonna cut me. Fuck. Nah. Uh, okay. Hey, There's I don't think you're about that. Hold up. Where's the, uh... I'll take care of it. That was... I, I thought there'd be more to it. <laughs> That's funny. That kind of- that was honestly a bit unfair, oh, considering shit. the fact that, like, I didn't know I had to do slash PvP. Oh, I've literally oh, never done yeah. that before, Nothing. so that's funny. Nothing. Can I ask your name? Hey, who? The fella who just knocked out the guy. That's funny. That honestly wasn't like even fair. <laughs> but it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. <laughs> That's funny though. It be that way.
Well, now to wait 180 some seconds. That's funny. That honestly kind of sucked, but like, you know. That was funny, though. <laughs> oh, I had to, like, try to make some sort of excuse on, like, you know, I don't understand why my uh, punch muscle ain't working. <laughs> and it was like, oh, yeah, slash PvP, like, when I'm at half health. That's funny. User left your channel. Excuse me. User joined your channel. <clears throat> User left your channel. User left your channel. Ah, uh, here we go, boys. Uh. Lucky bastard. I it's not lucky me one man. Well, my punch muscle wasn't working at first, so uh that, that was a bit unfortunate. Arms. Yeah. User joined your channel. You know it's been a while since I've been in a good old fashioned uh, brawl fight, so uh yeah, I, I was a bit I was a bit rusty. Like a, a wet noodle. Yeah, sure. <sighs> yeah, wet noodle. We'll have to rematch again sometime, uh, guitars. Next time Dude, you may no. not be as lucky. <laughs> I, I really know. Uh, right now my jaw's killing me at the moment, but, uh, <laughs> I'll definitely consider it a bit later. Okay. Appreciate that. What's... 
Is that just a kind of charity from you? His name's Finley. I like uh, enterprising business people. Well, I appreciate it. I'll Especially make sure. when they're so kind and so offer to help this place. Oh, yeah, always. I'm like, I'll help out just about anyone I can, to be honest with you. I'm just doing the Lord's work. Still. Have a Excuse couple Excuse me. Alright, I appreciate it. Because you are so ugly. Say, so, Moses, did you see the telegram about that uh, artist person? Yeah, I'm not too worried about him coming down here. Interesting, I hear a. Uh... Here's some music going on in my head for some reason. No. Hey, Floyd. Uh, Ari and I have somewhere to be. Uh, I'm gonna have to hop the train. You think you and Mark can hold the fort down? Yeah, I don't know why the uh, that music's playing, guys. It'd be cool if that was playing like when I was uh, in a bar fight, but. Uh, these people fighting. You done? Hey, uh, Moses, I hear you and Ari are going somewhere. Yeah. Is everything alright? Yeah, everything's fine. We're just, uh, just meeting with somebody. Yeah, I don't know why the uh, Red Dead mus fight music's going on. Where's my? Yeah, I don't, I don't understand. Oh, nice, hey Shorty. Hey, hey Floyd. Yeah, I don't know why the, uh... I don't know why the, uh... Red Dead fight music's going on. Thank you. I mean, I like it. It sounds cool and all, but, like, you know... I just don't understand the reason why, but okay. Yeah, no, 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 no,
You'll miss out on this one, I guess. I'm gonna let up. Okay, I think that fixed it. Yeah, that fixed it. Okay. Thank goodness. <laughs> Say, Floyd, do you know where uh, Kathleen went by any chance? I haven't seen her today. Alright. Just wondering. I'm not worried about Hardy because he told me he had to catch a train, but, uh... Still better to be safe than sorry. Oh, there's blood here for some reason. Happened, but okay. User joined your channel. Okay, let's do that. By the way, Miss Ari, I don't know if you're, uh, you're going to be catching another train. Actually, we're staying here, so we're just gonna go head off, take care of the business. Alright, that's fine. I was just uh, wondering, because uh, last time I was here, I know I went somewhere else, so I didn't really uh, clock out <laughs> over here for, for me to get paid and such, so I didn't know if you were going to be uh, heading oh, out shit. as well. But uh, uh, that's no, it's no rush right now. I just, uh, I was just wondering, is all. No, 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 here. Are y'all going to another district to talk with him? There. Alright, thank you. Uh, we're staying here. You're not leaving? The, nah, the wait to get onto the train is too ridiculous. Alright, does anyone need to ride back to town or anything like that? Or be headed back to Black Order? Y'all going to be uh, talking to. All right, well, y'all have a good one. Thanks for the hospitality. And uh, Miss Arizona, if you need anything, you just uh, reach out. All right. Yeah, uh, I'll send you a letter. All right, sounds good. Hold on. I gotta... All right, y'all be safe, okay? You too. Yeah, you too. We'll be sticking around. What are you doing, you weirdo? You laying next to her? Yep. Victory pose. You get run over by the wagon. Oh, fuck. See? This is okay, hold on. That's creepy. That's what I was saying. See, they're honest. <laughs> hey, Floyd, i talk to you for a second. Yeah. I'm uh, not trying to sound nosy or anything, but uh. Howdy. Howdy. Uh, 
I was just uh, wondering if you knew exactly uh, where uh, Ari and uh, Moses were going to go talk to, because they said they had some business going on. No idea. I don't know where they didn't tell me anything, honestly. <sighs> all right. Well, if it's they just, just if it's just personal. All right. Well, if it's just personal time with by themselves, then I understand. I'm just trying to make sure it has nothing to do with. Uh, oh yeah. Exactly. Oh, uh, that's why I was asking them myself, because I didn't know, and they said they're staying, so I guess they're not going to talk to them if you get through it. Who the fuck was all that that just passed in town? User left your town. Uh, I don't know. You guys uh, recognize one. any of them? Nope. Great. Where'd they go? Yeah, the fellow in the red plaid, I think his name is Jim. I mean... They headed east. But that's all I know. How many of them was it? Was it, James? Like, five? Four. Four or five. Four in the wagon, and then three people, three or four people just rode by, following them. Oh, shit. Why? Should we be worried? Uh, it's a good thing going hiking. Uh, let's just hope that we don't have to worry about anything. We won't have to when we're hiking. They ain't only gonna find us up there unless they got some crystal ball. We've been talking to some uh, tarot card readers or something. Mm. Oh, you said you were going hiking. Yeah. You're welcome to join us. Yeah, might as well. I mean, I'm not doing anything over here, so... I'm just trying to complete my bucket list. Yeah, mm -hmm. I, just, she I understand, Is she tied up in your ass? Uh, I think so. Can you mind carrying her to the doctor's office? I don't want to... Sure. ...mess her spine up just in case. And then check down here. Here we go. Guess I'll do the same, just in case. User joined your channel. Perfectly fine. I was feeling great. All right. You heading out now? Yeah. So yeah, guys, this yeah. this guy right here with the mask on. Um, hey, do you remember where that where that path starts? Okay. Okay, I don't think so. But this guy right here that I'm going comes. hiking with Floyd, he uh, his character has tuberculosis, so okay, I'll follow you then. he's slowly dying. So he's completing all the bucket lists that he wanted. He's a good friend of Shields, so.
Was it? Where are you going? Sorry about that. I didn't send anything. You but Ah, uh, fuck it. People will come down here and see. Okay, yeah. Means they'll be out of our way. That's all I can. Looks like a good screenshot. I'm gonna do that. Nice. And the dude got into frame just in time too, so that was nice. Ah, man. R.I.P. Floyd Marshall. Dude. So, this place we're going, where is it? Uh, it's uh, Mount Sean, I think. User left your channel. Near Big Valley. Alright. Good place as any for a hockey trip. Let's go about to see who that squirrel with the six shooter. I'm sorry. Uh, you'll see it when we get there. Just don't kick it off, because then uh, nobody will be able to see it. Squirrel with a six shooter, you say? That's interesting. Mm -hmm. There's some yeah. John's bones, too. Oh, yeah, I know what, uh, I think I went down there one time with uh, someone, uh, snowy area, right? Up on that mountain with that giant, uh. I've there a few times. Yeah, I think I've uh, been around that area. I don't know if I've been on the exact track you're talking about. Yeah, it's uh, if Ruth knows the way, I, I'm having a hard time remembering it, to be honest. That's all I'll say, just rip Floyd. <laughs> That's so sad. Uh. 
guess this way, yeah. With Teddy. I have not seen Teddy here in such a long time. Cougar. That's a cougar. Keep going. Y'all keep going. I got it. Keep going. I got it. What are you planning on uh, going, Floyd? What's that? I uh, just asked what else you're planning on going. Like, where else? I don't know yet. I haven't thought about it. I know where I am ending up, that's for damn sure. that know about this? Oh, my family's dead. These blood relatives, is that what you meant? Yeah, just any sort of, uh, any sort of family. Siblings, wife, fiance, that sort of thing. <laughs> oh, no, I'm not gonna give my ex-wife the time of day and don't mad at her either. We ain't been together in a year and a half. As for... Blood family, I don't know where my brother is. My other brother's dead, my father's dead, and so is my mother. Oh shit, I'm sorry about that. To be honest, I don't know where my uh, family is. At least right. my blood father and my blood mother. What's 
Let's go. We're starting from here. Alright. Grab my backpack and some other things. Yeah, I, uh, well, let's just say I never knew my father or mother. So, uh, I suppose I can say that I know what it's like. <laughs> family, per se, that I knew were some elders in a village. They took me in when I was around, uh, three, four years old, and, uh, well, they just looked after me ever since. They named me, they, uh, fed me, clothed me, taught me the ways of different things, and, uh, by 16, 17, I settled out, and, uh, yeah, met oh, Veronica, man. and... What's your game putting on that man? And me. Oh, unfortunately, she uh, got killed. Sorry. So, uh, that's True. all right. You ready, Ruth? Ready. Used to it by now. Remember which route we're going to take. You gotta walk this way. I can't find how in this world. So. Like this way. Don't worry about it. Okay, come with me. <laughs> Very confident in your abilities. <laughs> it's so yeah, guys, it looks like the next hour at least will probably be uh, hiking, so that's cool. <sighs> Being with Floyd in his last moments. Pretty nice here. Well, I take it if you hike here at night, it, it's not the best idea, but. Uh... <laughs> yeah, well, majority of the fun things usually aren't the best idea. <laughs> uh, to be honest, it's been a while since I've been hiking. Can't remember the last time I went, honestly. Quite peaceful, that's for sure. So pretty around here, too. So. We're gonna want to start at this park right here. And this takes us to the, uh, the one we're looking for. Mm -hmm. so. This is actually, like, quite nice, guys. Like... Shields a lot about uh, someone he knew in his past called Red. Uh, his appearance kind of a cool kind of thing, but... His attitude and like his character reminds him a lot about Red. I'd say Floyd and a character on here called Jerome reminds Shields of Red a lot. 
so when Floyd passes, that's definitely going to be a, a little tough for Shields. Being here fully twice, once I just kind of did. In time, I was looking for uh, Manuel and fucking Foxy took him. He's Foxy. Well, he's really not around when Foxy was around. Use God, he's this channel. little fucking fox guy. Bunch of animal, you know, Goosey? Basically, mm -hmm. her group, and they wanted me dead. They were like, but Foxy User especially. Because, um, one day he uh, kidnapped Frank. Uh, what am I saying? Um, Fred. He kidnapped Fred. He did some horrendous shit to him. He robbed him of his cult and everything. I seen him in the saloon the next day, so I fucking robbed him back. Um. Yeah, he ended up sending out telegrams every time he was around, saying, Ruthie, Ruthie, come out and play. He never got me, which is good, but he got Manny one day and carved Manny, and fucking Manny has a scar saying Ruth on his back. Kinda weird. Manny did. Yeah, um... User joined your channel. He's, he, he's a fucking weirdo. Sounds like it. Yeah, I found some um, thing up here in one of the mountains. I'm about to come up on the Wendigo bones. What's a Wendigo? Wendigo. I wish Lassie was here. Wendigos are terrifying creatures. Gowies. Hey. Yeah, it's Australian. Australian, yeah. I mean, okay. I'll use more. Like, Australian, but yeah. Interesting! It's same thing. User joined your channel. The Wendigo is not a Bigfoot. Wendigo is, oh, okay. a, yeah, is a cannibalistic like a monster yeah. that'll rip you in half with right. their hands. Bigfoot will probably do the same to you, too. Probably, yeah. That's. Definitely not a creature you want to mess with. No, oh, Wendigos are terrifying. They're fast as hell. They're faster than fucking cougars. You blink, they've already moved like a hundred feet. Faster. Stronger. Deadlier. Psychological. There's that weird swirly thing up there. I never knew what it was, but it's a weird symbol, nonetheless. Yeah, that's it. Weird. Looks like stairs. Yeah. I reckon maybe our. Uh... <laughs> there's a. I. There's a mine <laughs> shaft around here somewhere, like down in the parts. Go hmm. inside it. There's another cave, but I can't really recall where it is. Maybe our great grandchildren will figure out those symbols. Here we go. There it is, the Wendigo. That's fucking creepy. Oh my god. What in the hell? It's James's ancestors right there. Yep. You can tell by the oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah, you're I'm sorry. about sorry. to curse yourself. You're cursed. You're no, it's, it's fun with my ancestors. It's fun. I was gonna say, you can tell it's, you know, from my heritage because it's got the, that beautiful hair. It just stayed this whole time. <laughs> yeah. We're more lighthearted once we get to the top. <sighs> Let's six. move along, please. Mm -hmm. You seen him? I've seen him. Watch the sunrise up here a few times. Pretty. Yeah, I like it. I hinted it, but I didn't do it. Uh, <sighs> if 
If only they knew the power of the Wendigo. Oh. Very powerful. If only they knew. Oh. Oh. Are you sure we're going the right way? Let's just check it out this way, yeah. Oh. oh, it's this. Oh, yeah, look at this thing. Looks like a compass. Like half of a compass. I wonder why the north is pointing that way. Yeah, I've seen those symbols before. I don't know what the point of it is, though. It's probably dying? some sort of a carving of some sort, maybe sacred thing. Interested. Oh, and the paler's over there, too. Forgot about the paler. I think it's just Mountain Gear to a wrap. That is the situation. Yeah, he's up here. You okay? Get him. Oh uh, I'm sorry. Say it again. Are you alright? He's got my best. Uh, yeah, just. thought of a bad memory, that's all. Mm. What? Here's your squirrel with the six shooter. That's a hell of a sight, that's for sure. Over here, over here, over here. Yeah. Lord of the Sprout. <laughs> I don't know who the hell put that up here, but... Uh, <laughs> What's it doing? Pointing at the sunset? Or the sunrise? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> Had your chance, you lid. <laughs> ah, that's actually a really, uh, brilliant thing right here. <laughs> it's got my vest and shirt, too. <laughs> oh, what the hell? That's, that's the, that ain't that right. Ah, uh, maybe it's your descendant, Floyd. Maybe. No, no, no. My spirit animal. It's a squirrel, apparently. <laughs> Hell yeah. I heard mine's a raccoon. I think mine is a uh, deer. Uh, at least that's what my last name means. Shaden means fawn, young deer. Believe it or not. Oh, look at that. Well, would you look at that? But he's gorgeous. That is, uh, that's a hell of a sight right there. Hold on a second, I just need to. That's nice. You can see the river, the mountains, the clouds. You can even 
and see the glare of the sunset. That's a beauty right there. One thing I want to do while we're here, actually, before we, uh... User joined your channel. I'm running out, but... <laughs> what are you doing, Dan? Guys, this is rocks. sad, dude. <laughs> Bet you can hit the river from here. You almost got yeah. that one. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> Think I can nail one of these birds? Put a little elbow grease in there. Fucking dig on! Say goodnight! Oh. Almost. Just gotta <laughs> warm up! Could you imagine canoeing down this thing? I could, actually. You left your channel. And I am. It is very shallow, not doable. I better stop for I cause a landslide. You or I fill it up. User left your channel. You do this hike every day after your workouts. You might be in extra good shape. Yeah, I don't know about all that, champ. <laughs> There's the pillar of truth. The first time I came, oh, I just remembered his name. Edwin. Who's this, uh, Ed Edwin fella? Edwin was the man who showed me all these places. He was a very mysterious man, in fact. Dressed like Jesus Christ reincarnate. Wore robes, no shoes. Mm. He was, uh... His voice echoed and had this resonance to it. It was eerie, to say the least. Most people didn't talk to him. Most people were just kind of weirded out by them, but every time I went on some kind of peace spirit journey with him, it would always bring me some kind of light. He always had some kind of imparting wisdom without giving me any words. He would take me to places and just let me talk. He so, was... this... Is he still around? I don't think so. I haven't seen him. He was just oh, ugh. just as ugh. just as mysterious in life as he was in his disappearance. He came and went. Ugh. 
Hold on, I got you. User joined your channel. Oh Lord! <laughs> what? <laughs> question is did Floyd get up <laughs> I don't know why <laughs> I don't know why I just went flying that was funny Left your I don't know how you're getting down. Oh. oh, I did the wrong thing. I did the wrong thing. Ooh, I think we all just died, folks. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Okay, bruh. Joined your channel. <laughs> oh, you all all right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah we User joined your channel. <laughs> Quick way down. Yeah. And then back up. Yeah, I don't think I'm getting back up there, guys. joined your channel. <laughs> Everyone's just struggling. I don't think we're getting back up here. Yeah, 
I hear you. Alright, oh. Hey, look at that. Yeah, I don't think we're getting back up there. <coughs> we're gonna have to go back up this mountain after, because I gotta go do something after this. We can take our horses for that trip, though. Where are you keeping that? Um, Don't ask Ruth where she keeps things. Oh, was that rude? She just has very. You all right? Deep pockets. I've been better. You need something to eat? Help you feel a little better? Uh, yeah, that may help. Thank you. I may have something. Let me check. Thank you. Yeah. I was been camping here for the night. I've seen that at Big Valley. That's, uh... It's... Oh my god. What's this? Well, who's up for some adventure, huh? Um, oh no, be. This is Is this it? That's not very big. That's what she said. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Is this a uh, native territory or something? Uh, that why I don't think so. No, I don't think they much care for the coal mines. I wonder what, that, uh, wonder what that skull was about then. Maybe someone likes to hunker down here every once in a while. Not a bad place, honestly. Keep the cold out. Certainly creepy enough. Also, I don't think natives would use bear skulls. I think bears are like spiritual guardians or something for them. That's what I'm saying. Maybe they placed it there to. Maybe someone rests there or something? I don't know. Yeah, that's our Cohen. Um, are we heading back to strip or are we heading back? Yeah, we'll get back. Grab our horses and we can go through Big Valley. I gotta go up somewhere and do something. Probably go up this way, trying to find boobs. Got a 
To be honest, I'm surprised we haven't gotten attacked by wolves yet. Anybody got any uh, wood around to knock on? Uh, unfortunately not. I didn't think about bringing it. Pig, come. I don't think it worked. Ah, they didn't hear me. How you holding up? I'm just catching my breath a little bit. Hope you don't love those gloves too much. <laughs> yeah. Well, uh, nice gloves, ain't they? Yeah. Guys, I'm literally, like, almost in tears, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> oh, man, that sucks. If you need to rest for a second, Floyd, just, just holler, alright? Yeah, well, yeah. be honest, I don't think I really got to, uh, ask you what you like doing most of the time. <clears throat> fighting and canoeing. <laughs> oh, fighting spirit. One of my bucket lists is win 200 fights before I die. How many you won so far? I gotta win 12 more. Then I'll be at 200 and... 200 wins and 76 losses. Oh, I didn't Correct. know you kept count. That's, a. Uh... Oh, yeah. I write it down. <laughs> In your journal? Hmm. I'm at 188 right now and 76, I think, or 78. Uh, 76, yeah. 188 and 76. What type of uh, fights? Is it just any fights? Brawl fights? Fist fights, fist fights, yeah. Ah, fair, fist fair, fights. fair brawls. Yeah, I think the main thing I keep track of is uh, how many duels I win. <laughs> There's only one duel I wanted to do, but if the man's too coward to do it, then oh well. Ah, uh, well. Since I'm, uh. I'm gonna see how long I can, uh hold my shit before I end up shooting him in the face, but, uh, maybe I can arrange something where, uh, I can set, let you two fight, fight it out in a duel, that sort of thing. I guess I was getting chased by wolves or something over there. So you ran off and left Ruth? But you weren't the one getting chased by wolves. I was going towards the danger. I saved y'all's life, alright? Uh, I need some thanks and five bucks to meet you. Where'd she go? Where is she coming from? So is that up ahead? Cotton eye joke. <laughs> Sorry. I love my spirit animal. Oh, the raccoon. User User left left channel. Channel. What's my spirit animal? 
Mm. A cat. <laughs> a cat? Yeah. Why is that? Give me just a moment. Yeah. I'll meet you guys in Strawberry. You sure? Yeah. Okay. Y'all go on ahead. I'm gonna make sure she's okay. Okay. Come on. Yeah, go on ahead with me. I'll make sure she's okay. Are you sure? I can stay here if you need me to. No, sir. I'd rather make sure those two are alright. Alright. It's your spirit animal again. Yep. Oh, and a little rat. That's your spirit animal. Oh, come on now. <laughs> That's a bit harsh, ain't it? <laughs> Just kidding. Oh, I'm trying to think of like a like a. Hmm. I don't know, maybe more of like a like a bird of some sort. I'm trying to think of something that's like a, maybe like an owl. Something that, you know, watches a lot. Knowledgeable. You ride a lot, you get a lot of stories. That's fair well, enough. That's much more flattering than a rat, thank you. Yeah, there's a there's a lot of good qualities about a rat. True. The fact that they're small and can get away from danger easier? That's the only thing I find good about them. <laughs> and that's not even good, that's just benefits they got for themselves and survival. True enough, I suppose. I don't know if I want to be compared to rats or roaches or anything that's just good at surviving. <laughs> yeah. Like I said, that was a bit harsh. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, you all right? I noticed you, uh, had a moment there on the mountain. Um, what moment? With the bones. Uh, yeah, just bad, 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 uh, bad memories is all. Well, I'm sorry. I hope the view at least made up for it. And the squirrel. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, I've dealt with this memory for a very long time, and I don't see it going away anytime soon, so... <laughs> yeah, it just happens, it comes and goes. Yeah. Alright, let's go. As if I should probably stay back with Floyd since it's raining. Hopefully he'll be okay with just Ruth. <sighs> yeah. Besides, he wouldn't send us on ahead if it wasn't something real important. Have they known each other for a while, or...? As far as I can tell. The unstoppable James is pushing straight on ahead. <laughs> yep, roads are for cowards. And people who don't like bears. There's a, no. <laughs> well, I promise you there's gonna be no bears up yeah. on this hill. Yeah, That's I don't good. see any bears. I know at night sometimes there's the occasional wolf pack around uh, Strawberry, but uh, that's all I've remembered. I haven't seen anything more severe than that. I met my first uh, grizzly before the last storm. Oh, really? How was that encounter? Oh, uh, I don't think this door opens. Well, the grizzly doesn't have to worry about uh, the door doesn't open. anymore. They've locked it. Those sons of bitches. 
They knew you would come this way, James. Hmm. Yeah, it looks like we're going around. Cutter saw trailblazing. Anyway, I ended up uh, putting two slugs in the bear, so I took care of that. Yeah, I came across a grizzly bear with a friend of mine, and uh, she got bit a bit, but uh, I was able to uh, fight the bear off. Those sons of bitches can take a lot of bullets, that's for sure. Yeah, a lot fucking... of bullets. They are tough. A big mound of muscle is what it is. This is beautiful. Never been out hiking like that before. Yeah, it's been a minute since I've done it. I don't think I've, uh, I can't remember the first time I did it. That may have been my first time. Doubt it, but, uh, who knows. I wish there was a gunsmith around here, I would have, uh, probably purchased a shotgun. Yeah, shotgun's yeah. pretty handy. Yeah, something I've wanted to get, but just never could wrap my, ra um, wrap my mind around when I would get it, you know? <laughs> yeah. Definitely handy for, uh, if you don't really care about getting anything out of the predator that's coming after you. Oh yeah, that's for sure. I know with cougars, it uh, kills them pretty quick. Yeah, thank goodness. Killing them quick is the only way. Yeah, they keep coming after you, then they pounce on you, and they go for the neck, and it can get ugly real fast if you're not careful. They weren't quite able to get through James, though. <laughs> they tried. How's your back feel, James? Uh, should be alright. I'm still gonna get Fernie to look at it for me. But... Of course, you don't want it to get infected. Yeah, uh... Should be alright, though. Alright. I'm gonna find a place to use the bathroom. I'll be right back. where uh, Floyd and Ruth are. Well, hopefully they'll just be back soon. Yeah. wonder what they're talking about. That's what, uh, that's what I was wondering. Floyd tell you he's sick? Yeah. Uh, he tell you how bad? I know he's had it for about maybe two, three weeks from what I hear. He just found out a few days ago, I think, so. Yeah, it's been pretty serious. Yeah, I noticed on the hike he kept uh, trailing behind a bit, catching his breath and such. doesn't 
deserve to go like that. Nobody ever does. And yet, here we are. Yeah. I mean, I keep telling myself maybe there's some sort of uh, miracle that happens where he feels better. But, uh... I don't think I ever heard of that happening with this. That's what I'm saying. First time for everything, I suppose, but mm. with this case, I don't know. I'm just I'm trying to prepare myself, is all. Yeah, uh, known him for about a month, month and a half. One time with uh, the Rolando, Serena, and uh, can't think of the fellow's name, Michael, I believe his name was. And uh, that's the first time I met him. After I met him, I was like, <laughs> he reminds me a lot about my old partner, Red. He's like a brother to me. Red? Yeah. Not a... It's not a... He's not in state. He's a old friend of mine. He, uh... He passed away, I'd say, maybe, uh... Four or five years ago. I'm sorry. Well, it's... Have you ever ran a gang? been part of a gang that's not just a group, but family. You could say that. That, uh, well, that's what the free radicals were. Family. Is that who you were part of with Red? Tell me about them. Well, you first meet them, you'd think we were a bunch of nut jobs just trying to make our way in the world, do odd jobs here and there. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> well, we did more than that. We, uh, we saw some flaws. We said to correct them. There was a mayor we knew about. Ended up being corrupt. Well, we did what we had to do. The town was a safer place. We, uh, <sighs> I met two particular, no, uh, three actually, three particular individuals that uh, I would never think would stab me in the back at all. Uh, one of my best friends, Ken. Ken Valentine, and uh, two other ladies, Scarlett, Lisa, they were hell of a women, that's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> I uh, thought about getting serious with one of them, and uh, well, before anything more could happen, uh, Scarlett, she she got shot and uh, bled out in my arms. And, uh, well, after she died, she told me to keep a promise to her. She said, Shields. All I ever want you to be is happy. All this time you've tried to make me happy, but... Hello? You didn't realize I was already happy being with you. She made me promise, she said, Shields, if you want to keep making me happy, be with Elisa. I 
know how you look at her. And, uh, I know you care. So, I kept my promise. I talked to Elisa. She agreed. A few years later, we, uh, well, I needed to move along and get ready to uh, have property. I was going to stay with her. I was investing in a house. I uh, got the money, got the house, went back, picked her up, and uh, that's when it happened. Sound so deafening that it took me a minute to realize it was a gunshot. She got shot in front of me. Who? I'm sorry. Who would have done that? find that out myself. I've... It's been three months since I last saw her. I uh, came to state, looked around, found nothing. You think she's here? Uh, or her killer? I don't know. I doubt it. I mean, the only thing I knew about the killer is uh, the bullet that was in her head. Uh, it had a card in it. Some sort of uh, wild card. It was. Something you see in, like, a poker game, that sort of thing, and that's all I've been able to find. Uh, like I said, I doubt they're in state, at least now, but I swear to God, whenever I find, find out who did this, I'm, it's going to be the last thing he does. Shields, if, if you ever need someone to help... I, I'm good at looking for things, at finding things. If you find a trail, I might be able to at least help you yeah, follow yeah. it. I appreciate that. I, uh, User left your channel. Like I said, it seems like the trail, as you say, went cold when I arrived here, so... I doubt they're in state, if they are. Probably running across the country, channel. but I, there's nothing I can do. y'all's names. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Finley. Uh, Finley. I'm James. A pleasure to meet you both. Likewise. I hope he's alright. 
Should have been so back good. by now. You should have, yeah. It didn't take us that long to get back here. Should we go look for him? Mm -hmm. Oh, there they are. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> Had me worried. <laughs> me too. You're a good man, Shields. I'm glad we got to have this talk and this hike. Alright. Y'all good? Yep. We ready to go do some canoeing. Canoeing, huh? <laughs> I, uh, I'm actually, I think I may, uh, head to bed, head to sleep, so. Oh, alright, no worries. It was nice hiking with y'all. Yeah, of course. I'll, uh, probably fall asleep here and, and everything. Are you going to, uh, are you going to wake up again tomorrow, Floyd? Well, if I don't, then I'm dead. <laughs> Let's not hope that happens yet, shall we? <laughs> mm. Alright. I'll Take see you all. Chance. You too, Floyd. A good one. I'll see you all later. It's about to be the same. Damn. Sleep well, Shields. You too. Guys, I think I may end the stream right there. That was some nice uh, emotional RP. Not gonna lie. Uh, Y'all got to hear a little bit of Shields' backstory. So that was nice. Anyways, guys, if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Hope you all enjoyed the stream. Um, it was nice. It's really nice. Um, I'll probably be doing this again uh, sometime this week. Um, yeah, I, uh, I'm honestly trying to balance my emotions here. <laughs> oh, man, that was nice. Okay. All right, folks. Well, thanks for tuning in. We had some nice chat. I know I talked to several of you. Uh, hope to catch you all soon. I will catch you all next time. <laughs> Shields, out. <laughs>